Hey everyone, happy Thursday. I think it's Thursday, I, yes. This is gonna be like a let's talk video. Um, Cause I've noticed a lot of got like a lot of you guys are, I don't know. I don't know, I'm kind of emotional right now. It's that time of month. Um, so let's get rolling into this. So the first topic that I wanna touch on, um, keto. I am still on keto. I know I took a week off of keto when CJ and I were in, um, I want to say Oklahoma, when we were in Ohio. Um, and I know that might upset some of you guys. And I'm going to be honest, I did not gain any weight from that. Um, I'm not going to tell you guys to have a cheat week if you're stuck. I'm not going to tell you guys to do that. You guys do what you're going to do. Um, but I know I started this channel out as strictly keto and just sitting and talking to you guys about keto stuff, but there's only so much I can talk to you guys about keto without repeating myself every video. Um, and this is not like I'm quitting YouTube or anything. This is just, I'm kind of changing up my style a little bit. Like I will still talk about keto. I will still do keto cook with me's and everything. Um, I'm just not going to do as much keto talks as I have been. And I, for, about this, I don't want you guys to think that I'm not doing keto anymore or anything. I'm still going to do it. Um, I need to figure out a gym to go to in my area. So that's still been a thing. And basically as soon as I moved back to Florida, CJ and I went to Ohio. So that kind of stalled a couple things. Um, but I was... We were super excited to go up there and I could meet his family and friends and everything. So we did that. It was kind of building up our relationship um, since we're in the new stage of our relationship. Um, we've been just taking time with each other instead of filming everything that we've been doing. I hope you guys understand that because it is a new relationship and I do really have feelings for this guy. So I don't want to submerge him into YouTube and like show you guys too much of him and like have him you know on camera and stuff I just wanted to keep a lot of things between him and I private so I really hope you guys understand that uh, thing regarding keto is I'm not trying to come off mean or anything in any way um, I'm not trying to discredit anyone for doing what they do but about two to three times a week I do get these messages I'm not gonna name anyone for this or the company that they work for but these people they contact me wanting to sign up and sell um, like keto products and just other like pills and powders and stuff and I don't believe in any of that guys um, I strictly believe in putting into your body natural food sources like meat cheese eggs produce um, things that aren't made in labs and things that are natural and healthy and don't like come off as healthy if you guys know what I mean um, like I've had a lot of people come up to me for selling keto coffee and yes it may work I don't know I haven't looked into it um, but coffee like what I drink just regular ground coffee is keto I, I don't believe there's any carbs in it the only carb intake that I get from my coffee is the, the sugar-free coffee creamer um, which I've told you guys what has two grams of net carbs per serving um, but that's it I don't I don't want to sound like an evil person for discrediting or or kind of coming off mean I guess to these people um, it's just what I believe in and you guys can see where it might get a little annoying where I get approached like so many times a week about these products so I will help anyone and everyone on getting started on actual keto like what groceries to buy what meals they want what yeah what meals they want to make um, desserts anything like that I won't sell you guys any protein shakes any keto shakes any any products like that I won't do that um, so that's been on my mind because uh, it, it just happened today and I, I feel like it came off a little mean so this person if you're watching this I'm sorry I didn't come I mean to come off mean it's just I'm annoyed and I just I believe in just natural stuff at the grocery store because I am an animal scientist 
Um, I know where meat and veggies and all that comes from. I know how it's all processed. And if you guys have any questions about how meat is processed and all that, please ask me and I will answer. Um, once I do get a car, um, I've been trying to get a job down here. It's been hard. I've been, I started my life over basically. So I, as you guys know, I sold my car in Colorado, so I have no car. Uh, but once I get a job and save up money for a car, you guys are going to see more vlogging style, like things that I'll be doing. Um, there'll be plenty of road trips to South Carolina to see CJ, because um, that's been a little hard because I feel bad because he's driving down all the time for me where I should drive up to him sometimes. So once I get a car, you'll see more vlogging, you'll see more adventures from like just me by myself, me with CJ in South Carolina. Who knows what you're going to see. It's going to be a lot of things. And then the last thing, the last reason why you guys haven't seen much from me is because I've been focusing on school um, at with my management degree because I am graduating in May. I'm hoping there's been a little like bumps in the road with that. But I've just been focusing on that because my classes right now are super hard and they're very time consuming. Um, so I hope you guys can understand about that. Um, it's been putting a lot of stress on me because I still haven't heard from the University of Florida yet and I'm kind of getting worried. I know it's still February and I shouldn't worry, but your girl wants to be a gator, you know, like go gators all, all day, every day, go gators. Um, so I've been trying to get as much schoolwork as I can done. And I know this video is a little short compared to the other videos, but I just wanted to talk sit down with you guys, let you guys know what's happening. Um, I don't want you guys, like I said earlier, I am still doing keto. I've been keto all day today. Um, for lunch, I had a bacon, egg, and cheese burrito. Um, so strictly keto. And then tonight, today's my dad's birthday actually, so happy birthday dad if you're watching this. Um, tonight for dinner, we're gonna have a couple steaks. And then we're having cauliflower french fries, yes. And then I might enjoy a adult beverage with my father to celebrate his birthday. So that's what's been going on. Um, I hope you guys understand everything. I've been feeling really bad and really guilty and I've kind of been upset because I know I haven't been filming keto stuff. Um, and I know I kind of fell off the keto wagon for a week, but in Ohio there's things that you can get up there to eat, which you can't get in Florida. Like Skyline Chili was really good um, and Frisch's. Uh, the couple of people that said you are from Ohio, you know, right? You guys know that you can't not have that stuff. Because let me tell you guys that are not from Ohio, they put tartar sauce on their hamburgers and it is honestly amazing. It sounds really weird and gross, but it's not. I can promise you that. Um, so that that happened. Um, there's a lot of hot fudge cakes that happened too that I'm not sorry for. And on that note, I'm going to end today's video. I'll see you guys on Saturday. Um, I'm planning on making Rocky Road fat bombs this weekend, so stay tuned for that. Um, it'll probably be a low-key weekend because CJ is going out of the country um, for his day job. <laughs> Um, it was kind of a short term or short notice thing, so I'm kind of bummed about that. So you guys are just stuck with me this weekend. So, wow, I'm really white. So I will see you guys on Saturday, and until then, bye y'all.